Hi Sagittarius, welcome to your weekly reading. I hope you're all doing really, really well. This reading is for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus sign Sagittarius. And if you like this reading, please like, subscribe, comment and share this content if that's what you'd like to do. I really love and appreciate you all so very much for all of your support on my channel. And for private readings specific to you, please visit katytarot.com. So let's take a look, Sagittarius, at your week ahead, calling in your angels and guides, spirit and source energy. This reading is general in nature, so please take what resonates for you personally and just leave what doesn't. This is where you're at currently, Sagittarius, what's below you, behind you, above you and coming in towards you. Let's take a look at your first message. Divine Feminine. So this is a beautiful energy here. Um, the Divine Feminine, of course, we all have Divine Masculine and Divine Feminine in ourselves, in our inner being. So you may be focused this week on your Divine Feminine nature. This may also be someone who represents the Divine Feminine coming into your life or around you this week. It says the frequency of the divine feminine supports our soft, receptive and nurturing side, facilitating our intuition and intrinsic understanding of our connection to the cosmos. So connection into spirit, your intuition is going to be heightened this week. There's an energy here of you being very nurturing and very receptive and very on point with your intuitive knowing. So beautiful energy here to start your reading of Sagittarius. Let's take a look at your next message. Harmony, beautiful harmony and balance coming into play here. It says you are able to feel a loving, balanced connection with everything. So there's a sense of well-being that's coming into play here. Perhaps you haven't felt this for a while, Sagittarius, where there's balance, harmony, well-being, a beautiful divine energy, a receptive energy. Perhaps this means that you just need you uh, you need to, or you're just going to take some time away from your red regular action. What you do this week, um, what you usually do this week is going to change. So a change in routine, or you know, maybe spirit is saying here for some of you to um, to think about how to harmonize an area or a relationship more in your life as well. So interesting, beautiful energy, of course, harmony and balance is a divine attribute which you will be carrying around in you, within you, channeling through you this week. So you may come into, sometimes when we carry these positive vibrations, sometimes we get into a situation, we find ourselves in a situation which can be uh, disharmonious because you're carrying harmony. Spirit is putting you in this situation to then help facilitate the harmony back into the situation. So that's just interesting to look out for. You're starting fresh with something new. It says a wonderful new beginning is blossoming in your life, in my life. So you're starting fresh. It's a new day. It's spring. I'm feeling that you're starting to um, flourish. There's, there's abundance coming into play here. So when I say it's spring, it's like an energy of renew, renewal and of freshness. And so I'm seeing that you may be starting back at a job. You may be starting into a relationship or you're starting fresh with a, someone in your life, a partner, a lover, um, a friendship, whatever it is, you're starting fresh, you know, and this could be something brand new. You're going into a new situation, brand new, or it could mean that you are starting fresh with someone or something that you're kind of going back into. You're joining it again or joining them again, but you're different. And you're bringing through this different divine energy, more receptive energy, perhaps. It's just different to how you were before. Attune to the call. Tune in and turn on. So you are very much in your power. I love this for you, Sagittarius. This beautiful energy of just going with the flow and of being in your center. And you know what it is intuitively this week that you need to do or say or just to receive in. And that's exactly what you're going to be doing. I'm seeing here you're tuning into your call, your intuition. And if someone 
does call you, okay? I'm seeing this in a literal sense for some of you. If someone is contacting you, you will know how to respond to that, you know, if it's unexpected. Because I'm seeing for some of you, it is an unexpected energy. I am seeing if there's been difficulty in a situation here, especially with the harmony um, coming in for you. I feel justice is going to be yours, okay? There's going to be a balancing happening here and, and you will respond according to harmony and balance. You respond according to your, your authentic self, okay? So I feel that if there's been disagreement, disharmony, um, balance, harmony, justice, is yours it's coming in this week or very soon so that's really wonderful um, let's take a look now at where you are currently perfect the nine of pentacles so in t talking in terms of material things and this could be in your home life for example or maybe in your work life material things your financial life perhaps there's an independence here so perhaps you're looking to gain more independence this week or looking ahead into your future you're looking to be very comfortable with where you are at with things um, materially financially and otherwise you are even in abundance so this could mean that you are stepping out on yourself by yourself in some way but are going to become more abundant financially or more abundant emotionally more abundant in your life in some way here you know you you are surrounded by beautiful things and I feel for the most part you're creating this yourself you know so this could be an internal thing you're creating an internal structure um, emotionally mentally and spiritually which is very uplifting and abundant for you but for some of you it's going to be more of an external thing and and that's coming through is very strong as well let's take a look at what is below you here so we have the four of swords Taking some downtime, perhaps some of you have not been feeling the best. So health wise, if that's the case, then you're starting to um, things are starting to pick up and look up here. This can also mean no, no communication. It can also indicate that you've had um, you've had a difficult battle with someone or a difficult, you know, this disharmony coming in here, not harmony that's coming in this week or very soon. But disharmony coming in here, perhaps you haven't really listened to your intuition or gone with the flow with your true inner being. You really are now though. I mean, look at this independent energy. You're comfortable in who you are. Perhaps in the past you haven't. You've been through some kind of battle um, or tumultuous energy. And like I said, perhaps no communication, but you've taken rest. Respite is there. Let's take a look at what is directly behind you. We have the two of pentacles having to decide on two things. It's been up, it's been down. You, you perhaps have been confused about it. You've chosen and it's going to work out for you or it has worked out for you. And you should be very proud about this because you're making it on your own in a lot of ways. Even if you're in a relationship or you know, you've got people around you, you're doing something for you or you're doing something that really is in alignment with yourself in an authentic way and it's so powerful so be proud of yourself here for that justice yes exactly what i was feeling justice is yours there is a truth there is a balance there is a harmony coming into play if you are involved in any kind of legal battle court system lawyers any agreement any contract any commitment like this it looks like it's going in your favor or at least it's going to be very very fair so you can bet on that it's going to be fair there may also be a libra as well around you and we have the five of swords now i'm seeing this because we've got justice here and you being so comfortable with the nine of pentacles i'm seeing this as you taking the lead here or you winning or being successful over an opponent or over competition or over negativity over your own negative thoughts okay you are taking control here um, there is definitely clarity as to who is in the right who is in the wrong there's a fairness that's coming out to play and that's very important a truthfulness is coming into the air and because of that harmony and balance can then follow so you've got beautiful new energy and you start coming in here um, and you are following your own true call um, the inner call what is really divinely inspired by you 
such a powerful read for you this week, Sagittarius. I hope you all have a wonderful week ahead and I'll talk to you all again soon.